You're still lingering like the old cologne that you wore. Something about you is pulling me back, and I'm holding. Hi Libra, welcome to my channel. We're doing your what's love got to do, got to do with it. <laughs> I was just feeling in love. I'm always in love with myself. Okay. Because that's how we roll. Sushi roll. Okay. <laughs> Let's begin. You guys already know this, right? It's already out. Crystal diffuser, the first of its kind. I cleanse it before you get it because every morning I go to the kitchen and it's all there. And it's like, okay, so this is all going for those people. So it's already ready for you. Abundance, healing, protection, and all the gels. Okay, um, we have restocked the number one seller protection incense kit. So you better get it while it's hot. And it might be the last time because we're changing the packaging ish. So it might become a collector's edition. <laughs> I like to say that, even though it's not gonna be a collector's. Why not? It makes me happy just saying it. And then why would I refuse to say that? I like it because you shouldn't tell. <laughs> Let me do the magical spell card. I can't be bothered, I swear. Mm -hmm. Life is too good to be bothered, you know? As long as we have air to breathe, but right now we don't wanna breathe the air. <laughs> Hold my hand, magical spell card, Libra. Ooh, you like this energy, okay? Because you're a workaholic. <laughs> Ouch, okay. A light inside my fire divine. Energy fill me, make me shine. Okay. So you're definitely vibing Libra. Mm -hmm. So you want to know how to invite energy. Energy is Mars. Um, a good Mars will be go, go, go. But with discipline. A bad Mars is going nowhere. And it leads to destruction. So Mars is that kind of energy. Okay? Just to give you guys a heads up. Mm -hmm. Well, right now Mars is in Cancer. So we might be... Uh, is it? I think Mars is going to Cancer. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah. Well, Mars is in Taurus. Yes. Then it's going to go Gemini. Then it's going to go Cancer. Okay? So be careful when Mars is in Cancer. <laughs> we might get a little bit, you know... Ah. Uh, you know what? Chill, chill. Okay. <laughs> right now, Mars is still in Rahu, so you have a lot of energy. Mm -hmm. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Yeah, you know. It's amplified. Say, dear, Vedic astrology, of course. Okay, eating habits. You want to change because you feel like you're lying to yourself that, no, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. <laughs> no, you're not. Okay. Okay, I hate to be a Libra right now, which I am. Mm hmm. Because your heart knows that you haven't been faithful to eating the food pyramid. You ate all the pyramid, they say. <laughs> okay. Um, you're having stress about making a right because you always make a laugh. Mm -hmm. You say here, why do I keep making the wrong decision? Mm -hmm. And every time I know where to go, I keep choosing the person who brings anger and anxiety to you because this is deceit and hostility. You're asking yourself, am I really, here's your guides, am I really dumb when I'm in love? Who is smart when they're in love? No one can think straight. No one. Mm -mm. So the question is, why think? Feel. Okay, feel. Mm. Don't think when you're in love. Feel it. Okay? Because your gut will tell you. Your logic is basically, um, uh, how do I say this? Already compromised when you're in love. You will not think straight. But your feelings has uh, will be the guide. Okay? Let me see what the message of the tarot. Mm -hmm.
Okay. Ah. First card is strongest Libra. Justice. Oh, if you guys want to know how to manifest, I thought, I thought, <laughs> I thought, what kind of teacher are you? I thought, I was teaching, okay, in the Divine Feminine, okay, <laughs> how to manifest. You guys always like that topic. Mm. What's your first card? You want to bring in your soulmate. You want to weigh things down. You want to understand what's the logic of being married. There's no logic to that, trust me. <laughs> okay. Unless there's kids, there's logic. If there's no kids, and it's companionship. If there's no kids and it's still not a companionship, you guys are just FBs. There, I said it. Okay, I said it. Nobody wants to admit it. It's just friends with benefits. I just want to know if it's HMO or PPO, what kind of benefits, like a health insurance. How much is the copay? Are they paying the rent? Because they're definitely writing you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. No sad, we love each other. Ah, oh, you're so mate. Two of cups. I love love. When I see people in love, oh my god. When I see people get engaged, oh my god. And then when I see people having rocky relationship, oh my god, more business for me. <laughs> exactly. Okay. So you guys love each other, yeah? Mm -hmm. There is an agreement. That's love, Sal. We feel the connection. Mm -hmm. And Sal, I feel like finally, this is it. Queen of Cups. I can show my vulnerable side, which is the Queen of Cups. The Queen of Swords is not vulnerable. Um, because they appreciate me. Aw, love that. Okay. Mm -hmm. And now I'm firing for divorce. <laughs> no, you're not. Judgment. Okay. I feel like I'm finally doing the right thing. Okay. Oh, I finally found the one. Mm -hmm. Someone to share my life. I finally found the one. Ten of Wands. It feels like a shared, um, shared labor or problem. It feels like right now what you're saying to yourself is we are able to understand each other and let go of all the things that made our life difficult. I feel like you're a couple who's working out things. Uh -huh. The kinks. Uh -huh. Because we love each other. Ace of Cups. Right? Mm -hmm. So having the Ace of Cups with the Justice and the Two of Cups, um, it feels like uh, you finally um, will get emotional satisfaction instead of rejection. Okay? And you're going to be very happy. Okay? Because Four of Pentacles mm -hmm. and the world, the hardship is over. Because I'm almost over you. No, you guys are almost over all the little fights that you guys have. Wow, mature. Love it. Then what is this hostile thing that you keep going back and forth though? Uh -huh. Excuse me. The Knight of Pentacles. Um, it feels like now you understand not to push things because you want to. Now you understand that, you know, real love takes time. And you're taking time. Being patient. Not your strong strongest card, but right now it's your strongest. Do you understand me? It's not in your characteristic to do that. You meet people halfway with the justice, but then we sell things. With temperance, we meet people halfway, then we basically kind of be patient with it and wait for things to just come out naturally. So now you're understanding that this relationship, before you even decide, you consider them, you try to understand them. I mean, they're lucky to have you, just saying. Okay. <laughs> Queen of Pentacles, you're a nurturer. You're a person who understands and appreciates relationship, takes time and patience. And because the Queen of Pentacles is appreciation, because she looks at it like, oh my God, you know, this is so important, it's special. We always meet people who are special, but we don't treat them like one, right? For me, everything is, everybody's special. Well, that's a problem because how you get a relationship when everybody's special? <laughs> You know, out myself like I'm a player. <laughs> I'm a bad news to date. Trust me on that. Okay. Because I know how things work. 
<laughs> and you'll be a frog if you cross me. Okay? <laughs> Queen of Wands and the Wheel of Fortune. It feels like life is about to turn around, Sal, and everything is good. It is. I see it here. Okay? It's all positive. We have Wheel of Fortune. Um, you're confident. You're emotionally secure. You have the uh, what? Queen, Queen, Queen. It feels like you're putting all the effort in this relationship. And the two of you are just in love. Okay. But you guys had a fight. <laughs> Five of swords. So everything was doing well. We had an argument. He walked away. I haven't heard from him. And I don't know what to do. That's why I'm stressed. Did I ruin it, Sal? Did we ruin it? Well, I'll continue this reading, guys. You guys are in separation after meeting the right one. Link down there in the description box below. And this is where I come in. I'll see you guys again. Bye. Oh my God. And now, they hop into their car. Chariot, they left you. Mm-hmm.